there's just something special. You put your heart into it. And on top of it, that bike has my brother's ashes in it. Um, so that's now gone with whoever took it. All right, everybody, you're going to see in this video two people, all right? Some of Albuquerque's finest. And yes, that is sarcasm in my voice. They have brought anger and heartbreak to a woman just trying to visit our city to do some good. So she's part of a group that call themselves the Moto Maidens. Mm -hmm. so what they do is they pick one state at a time, they meet there, and they ride all over that state for seven days, highlighting incredible women and organizations too. But now one of the women in this group is in tears after her motorcycle was stolen. <laughs> this group of women is so much more than just that. It's the five of us with this lust for life. We just want to be able to encourage women to go out there and experience life and adventure. My name's Mariah, and I ride a Harley Davidson Sportster. Mariah Harmony is part of the Moto Maidens. We are women that pick one state at a time. We all meet there, and we load up our bikes for seven days. We ride that whole state and highlight different women in that state, whether it's their businesses, that they're doing something extraordinary in their community, they have a story to tell. It's just highlighting women and highlighting that state and all the beauty that it has. But the beauty our state offers turned ugly because of these guys. Video from the home where they're staying shows two men steal a bike from the driveway around 2 Thursday morning. The neighbor said she had her window open and at 2.20 she heard a bike start and it was right next to her window that the bike started. So that means they hot wired my bike because um, the key's sitting in the house with me. It wasn't until this morning Harmony noticed her bike was gone. I walked out and I walked back in and I kind of stood there for a minute and kind of did one of these um, and then I started crying. <laughs> um, it, I'm just a, felt a little defeated. We came here to do something good for the state and my bike's gone. New Mexico is the third state for the Moto Maidens and the first where they're able to raise money for organizations beyond their home animal rescue organization in Louisiana. I was supposed to be taking pictures with my motorcycle with the dogs that are up for adoption. They're planning a charity ride benefiting Pitties and Kitties Rescue, Four Corners Wolf Sanctuary, and Española Humane. We're not going to stop. We're going to keep going. Um, we just want to help them. It's something really near and dear to our hearts and we get to ride while doing it, so what better way? <laughs> As for her bike, which is named Linda Lou. Linda Lou is straight out of the trailer park. <laughs> She's not the prettiest, but man, is she fun. It's more than just a motorcycle. I know how silly it sounds getting attached to a machine, but when you spend that amount of time physically on something and whether it's breakdowns or tears or smiling, going from all these places with your girlfriends and your friends, and you are the one constantly putting your time and your literally your heart and soul into something. That bike has saved my life more times than I can explain. Harmony says she's not holding her breath. It'll be returned. The thing is, is I don't have high expectations of getting my bike back at all, but I sure wouldn't be angry if I did. <laughs> So if you see her bike, Linda Lou, call police. By the way, you can watch more of the Moto Maiden's previous journeys on Harley Davidson's YouTube page.